Here's a CT scan of the abdomen and pelvis performed with contrast in a young patient with trauma. And as we scroll through the upper abdomen, we start to see some fluid around the hepatic margin and around the pancreas. And you can see that the fluid is predominantly retroperitoneal. It's surrounding the pancreas and duodenum and extending to the renal hyla and within the root of the mesentery. There is, when we scroll down into the pelvis, no free fluid in the cul de sac. So this is not hemoperitoneum, it's actually retroperitoneal fluid. Where is it coming from? Here's an interesting observation. A thin sliver of fluid interposed between the systemic vein and the pancreas. And this is significant because it draws our attention to this hypodensity in the neck of the pancreas, which is essentially a small pancreatic laceration. Uh, pancreatic injuries are important and need to be detected early after trauma. As failure to detect them can result in significant morbidity thereafter. There are some additional findings as well in the form of left renal laceration as well, but I, the purpose of this presentation is to highlight the feature of pancreatic injury. 